Becky. Welcome back to my channel. Make sure if you're new here that you subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos. I really hope that if you've been following along on my gift giving series this week that you've really found some great gift ideas, not just for Christmas, but any holiday or birthday that you have coming up for the kids in your life. And today is what we got our six-year-old for Christmas for her tree gifts. If you know what I mean by tree gift, I just mean the presents that she's getting under the tree. As I mentioned on my 12 year old daughter's video that they get the same amount of tree presents, they get the same amount of stocking stuffers, and so they she has five gifts for under the tree this year as well. Now one thing I think is really nice that I try to do for the girls is sometimes they get the same gift, even though they're six years apart, or sometimes they get something similar, and you'll see what, I'm, what I mean in a minute. As far as getting the same gift, one thing that both girls are getting this year, and I show this in my 12 year old daughter's video, is this Poppet um, Clay Creations Bakery Set. But basically, it's like Play-Doh, but it's air dry clay. So you create your little your little bakery creations using the different molds that come in the kit. They have different colors, and then you decorate them with like little fake sprinkles and glitter glue that looks like icing. And you get to keep them because you have like a little serving platter here, like a little counter display here, like a bakery. And I think both girls are gonna love that. My oldest daughter had something similar when she was younger that Crayola used to make and they discontinued it. And then I hadn't seen anything like it for years. And then now that this has come out, it's not by Crayola. Um, but now that this has come out, I'm really excited because my youngest daughter never had anything like it before. So I think she's going to be really excited to have something like this. And my oldest daughter's going to be really excited because she has had something similar and she loved it. So I think it's a really cute set. They have different sizes. You can get a smaller set of the bakery. You can get refills. You can get like, they have like a pet set where you can make dogs and cats. And I think it's really cute. And it's funny that both girls being six and 12 are really going to, I think, enjoy something, the same thing. So talking about something that's similar if you watch my what i got our 12 year old for her christmas gifts video then you would have seen that she got if i can find it <laughs> she got the the klutz sew your own mini treats kit or book um, and basically it's hand sewing all these different little plushy fruits and desserts and things like that and i thought she would really like that but my youngest daughter's my youngest daughter would really like that too, but she's not quite able to do that one yet. So I found one that was really good for her age group, and it's the My Studio Girl Make Your Own Travel Buddies. And this one, again, it still felt little plushy guys, but it comes pre-cut and it comes with pre like pre-stitched holes. So all she has to do is really work on threading through the holes. You stuff the little guy with the included um, stuffing, and it's got child safe needles. So everything in here is basically meant for her age group. So her being six. It's perfect that she's going to be able to not have to worry about getting the right holes. Um, I don't have to worry about going out and getting stuffing. I don't have to worry about going out and getting felt. Everything she needs is included. And it even comes with a little tin, like a little suitcase that the little animals sleep in. So I thought that was good for her because it's kind of similar to the, the Klutz one. It's a little bit more elaborate, but it's still meant for her age and something she's going to really have pride in creating. And I think it's really cute, and I will link that down below as well. If you watched my 12 year old's video, you saw that she got something similar. This is the Plush Craft Pop-In Plush, and it is a 3D styrofoam animal shape. They have all different animals, and it comes with pre-cut strips of fabric that you use the little puncher in, and it ends up making this three-dimensional fabric little animal guy. And I think it's really cute, something they're going to enjoy sitting out in their rooms. My oldest daughter has the panda bear, my youngest daughter has the bunny, and I thought it was really cute. And even though there is a six year, six year age difference, I think both girls will really enjoy this. Now my next gift for my six year old is kind of in the toy category. It also could sort of be, it's also educational, but I really don't think she's going to mind because she's going to enjoy the toy aspect of it. And I thought about giving her this just because we homeschool and I thought she would like to have it. But I think she loves to play shop and store, and I think she's going to love this Learning Resources Teaching Cash Register. And it is a very nice, like, high-end cash register, and it works with real money or the included play money. Um, and it teaches her about counting and making change. But again, like I said, she likes to have a little shop that she'll set up, and you have to come and buy things. And I think she's going to enjoy it from the toy aspect. I think we're going to enjoy using it in the homeschool room. So I think she's going to love it, even though it is educational. I think it's really fun. And so I decided to go ahead and give her that for Christmas. I debated on whether or not to give it to her for her birthday or just give it to her as part of school. But since it is a toy, even though it is a teaching toy, I think she's still going to enjoy it. And so I'm going to give her that for Christmas. And so her last tree gift, and if you watch my 12-year-old daughter's video, um, I mentioned I like to give them something kind of personal. They can personally use like jewelry or makeup or whatever, depending on their age, obviously. My oldest daughter got the, um, 
the little ring bracelet. So, and I thought my youngest daughter would really like to have this blanky tail. If you don't know what it is, a blanky tail is a blanket that's like this really soft, plushy fleece material, but it's long and then at the bottom it has a fin. So when you wear it and you slip inside of it, you look like a mermaid. And this one is their new pattern. It's like a limited edition, kind of an ombre rainbow design. Um, starts out pink and goes to purple and goes to aqua and then goes down to the green fin. And I wanted to get her this last year and I didn't, but I think this is the perfect year for it. I think she'll love it. This one's gonna, this one's the kid size. And so it's got a huge opening. I mean, I could use this thing and still have room left over. So I think this is gonna last her for a long time. And I'm really excited this year. I think she's gonna love it. And so that is her last uh, tree gift present. As you can see, I try to balance it out. I try to make it kind of similar whenever possible if I think both girls will enjoy something similar to each other. I had some extra items. She actually had too many gifts. I had to hold some of them back and save them for her birthday, but that's okay because her birthday's in January. You'll be seeing that video in a couple months of what I got her for her birthday. I say what I got her. I've had to force myself to say what we got her for Christmas because let's just be honest, maybe I'm wrong, but I do all the shopping in the family for my, you know, for my kids, for my, even my husband's parents a lot of times, I'm the one that goes out and gets their present. I don't think my husband has a clue what, what we've gotten them for Christmas and he's just as surprised as they are when we open gifts, but they're from him. I mean, obviously and they're from both of us, but I, if you catch me saying I got her, I got her, it's because I did pick it out. But I think it's a nice balance. I think she's gonna love everything. She's got things to play with, things that are personal like the blanket. She's got the little teaching toy. She's got the crafting things. So I think it's a nice mix of kind of all those categories that I try to try to keep in mind whenever I, I shop for the girls. And I hope you found some great gift ideas. Like I said, I'll have everything linked below. Make sure you like this video if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe. I will see you for tomorrow's gift giving video. Bye.